Alright, so we're finally on the track to find Sean. Or to start looking properly, at least. So Valentine's taking me towards this house, which is apparently where... I not want Ellie to hear this, but I think you should know. Everything I dug up about Kellogg before his disappearance is bad Why news. Buy just an He's more than just a mercenary. A He's a professional. A custom -made Quick, piece of clean, genuine. thorough. Has no enemies, because they're all dead. <laughs> Nine to one odds says he's our man. It's more than just you identifying his distinguishing features. The M.O. is all him as... Nick. Come on, Kellogg's house ain't far. That was my bad. I, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I was trying to find the button for walking, because I was running around like a lunatic. I accidentally threw a Molotov, so that happened. <laughs> so K Kellogg's bad news, not at all unexpected. He, I mean, he's he murders wives and has a scar on his face, and just uh, seems like an all-around bad dude. So it shouldn't come as a surprise to anyone at this point. Here we are. Keep an eye out, will you? See if I can get this open. Like that. <laughs> Let's see if I can Let's get this take a open. Take look around. Kellogg must have left something behind. Yeah, I already stole the key of this place. Sorry about that. Didn't, wasn't upfront about that. Ooh. Humans should not take junk. Less space for guns. You know what? You can use they junk to make small guns. To you. Figured a guy like Kellogg would think big. Well, he did take a warehouse and he fused it together. So this place should be bigger than normal. It should be attached to some kind of warehouse, isn't it? Or is that or is that what the Nothing second floor here. is? Did you check out that desk? Is that edible? Is that corn? Is that corn edible? How long has it been here? Handcuffs. Ooh, gold-plated lighter. I'm telling you, something's not right. Look for anything out of sorts. A switch, a button. There's a bed and a sleeping bag that helps indicate that Sean was here. I think it's Sean anyway. I because I, I, I said from the get the get-go that we probably aged out. Hello, button. Well, that's one way to hide a room. How did you not immediately check the desk yourself, buddy, Mr. Detective? Cigar when box. When it's stout beer, 44 caliber bullets, and cigars. San Francisco Sunlights. Hmm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere on its own, though. So much Nuka-Cola. Oh, lots of supplies in general, actually. Wow. Nuka Cherry. It is a cherry-flavored Nuka-Cola. I wasn't hallucinating when I read that briefly. Gas canister. It doesn't even say use. It's a good sign. Drugs? What's with the hard look? Say something. I'm looking around. That's creepy. There's a dummy in here. I'm grabbing all this shit. <laughs> I want to rob the fuck out of this guy just like how he took my son. How about that? How's there for mentality? Oops. What? The great clockwork dick is stumped? It's synth detective, jackass. If you're gonna be that way, you might as well get the make and model right. Joking aside, but what about dog meat? Commonwealth mutt like him can track a man sent for miles. Why don't you go fetch him and let him have a whiff? See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. We can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Why not? Why can't we just be a big crew? Any words of wisdom? If Kellogg really is the one who kidnapped your son. Then he's dangerous. But so are you. You don't need to be afraid of him or anything else the Commonwealth throws at you. I want you with me on this, Nick. The truck stop. Is the truck stop a base that I can actually develop? I feel like I should send everyone to Sanctuary Hills to defend it. Unless they're gonna not get along well or something. Alright. Let's get that bastard. This is your show from here on out, okay? You say jump, I'll say how high. Alright, now I like you a lot so far, so you'll be a fun person to have around, I think. Although, Strong is covered in a lot of equipment that I unloaded onto him. So, ah, eh, he's going to Sanctuary. 
That's where I want it to go anyway. Just have to go talk to him at some point, then walk up to the thing to unload it. I'm grabbing the crap out of his water. Hey, you mind keeping an eye out for a second? Gotta run a diagnostic. Whew. Thanks. What'd I miss? Yeah, you're right. I missed a lot. We never would have caught up, kept up with that. Thanks for warning me before you did that. I would, we would have been so screwed if we got caught in that one millisecond. Heads up. Go ahead. Hey, Valentine. Go ahead. Your thoughts? Who do you think actually won the war? Nobody, I guess. How are we doing, Nick? Hard to say. You know, some folks are just out for themselves. Some want to help those in need. Jury's still out which camp you're in. Oh, nothing. All right. All right, so I gotta get dog meat back if we're gonna be able to sniff out what's going on here. So might as well just look. A collection or something? You bet your ass I am. So might as well just load up on whatever we can find because we're just gonna walk outside and warp right back to sanctuary to find dog meat anyway. Can I warp there from here? Or do I have to walk outside first? Yay! Ah, you misled me. Come to think of it, before we head out. I might as well go visit our other friend's house, which is in town. Oh, dog meat. You're just here. Dog meat seems to just warp in and out. Sometimes, like, sometimes he's my companion, sometimes he's just kind of around. He catches me off guard. <laughs> Alright, hello. Dog meat. Get the scent, boy. I'm trusting my family's future to a dog. That's it. I'm officially crazy. And he loves you. The dog loves you. Let it happen. Just let it happen. Perk chart. All right. Well, what in the world do I want this time? It's always hard to decide. There's a lot of perks in general anyway. I wondered, I should look up whether or not you ever get more special points at some point. Like if I can go a little bit, bit deeper. Oh, better sniping skill. That's, that's a bummer. Yeah, perception is my high is my highest stat. There's still a bunch of perception skills down here. Let's see. This one requires perception 10. Va uh, in vats, every attack on the same body part gets 10% bonus accuracy. Penetrator, no place to hide. In vats, you can target an enemy's body part even if they're blocked by cover with a decrease of accuracy. And the sniper thing. Yeah, vats is a good one. So I assume... Oh, can I increase riflemen again? Oh, I can. We're high enough level already. Oh, I'm level 10. Cool. All right. Bam. People are going to be real scared in a moment. All right. I'm a scary rifleman. So what are you going to find, dog meat? I guess I should run because apparently his speed is determined by mine. Go, 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 dog meat. You don't know, Nat. You don't know nothing. Might as well call you Jon Snow. Strong hope we find milk of human kindness soon. Someday, super mutants kill everything. I like that they seem to travel around in real time. That's actually a kind of a cool touch. To see here. So we'll, we'll meet up with the, the detective in a little bit. And the, uh, the reporter in a little bit. But if we're already meeting... Do the dog, we might as well just go for it. Nice touch that having them just, him just show up outside the door. He seems to be a free agent that shows up wherever the hell he feels like. I actually get a kick out of the fact that characters seem to show up wherever sometimes. Like, I sent Strong back. And we just saw Strong outside, and he's not even in a big hurry to get back to Sanctuary. I assume he'll probably warp there if I go straight there, so, that I, I, so I don't have to look for him. Hello. Dirty ashtray. San Francisco Sunlights. San Francisco Sunlights. Dog meat find something? Kellogg's preferred brand, all right. What'd you find, dog mm. meat? What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? I love dogs. <laughs> he fucking rolled in it. <laughs> Weirdly enough, that's a behavior I never saw my dog do. My dog also never rolled in poop. That was a nice thing to have in a dog, is one that did not eat or roll in shit. <laughs> so I never quite experienced the worst thing about dogs that some people talk about. I just had a really sweet dog that was 
He was like clearly clever and kind of a dick sometimes. Uh oh. For me, that's always one of the big signs about how smart a dog is, is realizing that they're smart enough to, to try to deceive you. <laughs> oh, I am I am being a, I am being pursued here. Oh, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, they, they move fast. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Uh. There we go. Grab them guts. No, get off my, get off my dog. Oops. I might be a little bad at this. Got him. In the jump. Oh, that one's all radiated. Let's fix that. How's your lead content? Psych, they don't make bullets out of lead. It was all a ruse. Irradiated blood. Yeah, that's good to carry around. Be good for my rad level. Which I very rarely maintain because I want to make- I want to keep that rad away. I wonder how much my average radiation level is going to be before most uses of rad away in this playthrough. Because I'm already putting up with like a 15% or 20% right now. I'm bad at ju judging percentages based on a... just a meter like that. Quick save. Need to do that often, because death comes very abruptly in the open wasteland, where just any surprise enemy can show up and be super glowy and problematic. More clues of Kellogg. I'm surprised we're pursuing him so clearly already. Blood spatter. Oh, I was gonna inspect it. Oh, here we go. Ooh, two. Awesome. awesome. Looks like another one of Kellogg's pit stops. Keep your eyes open. Lots of ammo in his pit stops. I'm okay with this. What else is around here? More ammo. Biometric scanner. Those all seem... Oh, there's, it was turret parts is why. Those seem like handy things to have on hand. Hello, friend. Alright, what'd you, what'd you find, buddy? You find a corpse? Yeah, you did. Oh, more stim packs. Good job. Lost the scent, boy. You, you, come on, buddy. Just keep going. Nothing else? Can I, can I get past you or something? Am I supposed to... Bloodied bandages. Bloody bandages. Dog, Dog making track something? this. Kellogg's still out there. We've got to track him, boy. Okay, boy. Let's track him. There we go. So I just needed to find the specific thing. They were very specifically gating me from walking forward. At first I thought that something was glitched out, but nope, they're just being careful. Uh oh. Bad dogs. Only, they're gonna be one dog meat. Get, you meaty dogs need to get out of here. You're infringing upon the glory of dog meat. I'm giving them bullet enemas. Gross. Because they keep turning straight towards him. Ooh, glowy bits. Probably don't, need, probably don't need the flashlight too much yet. It's not night yet. I think the sun's going down. I'll keep it on. Probably helps you guys a little bit as the viewers sometimes. I know I know there was multiple people that were always thankful when I would, uh... When I would use the little light... Oh god! When I would use that small light source in, uh, Bloodborne. Hello, headshot. I'm gonna activate that crit on the third shot. Crit time! Get your bear stuff out of here. We stunned him. That'll help us out. But also... Oh god. <laughs> oh, he's up in this... He's... He's... He's in the air. Because of course he is. You have zero chance to hit. I know, I'm waiting for him to rotate into my view a little bit. Then I'll have him. He's not really doing that, is he? Let's just get in the point of view. There we go. Did his whole head explode? Damn, ooh. Oh, it's a Brahmin. Brahmin Ramen. Got a Yaogwai killed. Why does no one call them bears? That's weird. Are they really that different from normal ass bears? I can't really look at his face right now because it's off, but. <laughs> face off. But, uh. The Brahmin are at least crazy double headed mo monster cows, but the bears just seem to be bears as far as I can tell. Maybe they just forgot what bears are called? I don't know. Down we go. We're on an adventure, boy. You going in there? How, how many mines are you going to set up by walking in here? 
just don't trust interiors that much at the moment. But I got a nice rifle. Dog needs found something. You know the drill. So we need to find a drill. I got it. Disarm that. No one needs to be alerted to our presence. What's that? Campfire. Fuck! Welp. My arms are off now. I'm sorry, but what? I just reloaded my save when we killed the bear. Well, it automatically did that. This thing's right behind me. I did not see this behind me. What? What's going on here? Are you a merchant? I put my gun away. See? Who are you? Hey, pal. Are you buying or just in the way? Is this a merchant? You out here all by yourself? Hardly. Gus looks out for me. So I don't get any ideas. Now, are you buying or not? Yeah, Gus is scary. I've got a few minutes to browse. Just don't take too long. It makes Gus twitchy. Okay, now you're threatening me and I don't appreciate that kind of behavior, to be honest. Alright. I've been told that uh, money's not really much of an issue in this game in the long run. Which I've kind of... Ooh, bobby pins are apparently wor uh, cost nothing. I'll go ahead and just grab those so I just never have to worry about it. What does she have? She has some ammo. Value 5. I assume I could just buy a ton of those. She doesn't have a lot going on here, does she? Oh, ballistic fiber and adhesive. That sounds worthwhile, but I don't have a lot of reason to go after it right now. I'll just take some... There we go. Oh, no, don't, don't cancel. Uh, accept as R. Confirm. Okay. No, no accounting for taste. What? Shut up, I bought bobby pins. Alright, we're back in here. Let's be careful this time. I was already kind of being careful, but that one caught me out by surprise. The mine. Can I just not see it from a distance? There's just a leg sticking out, which is a freaky sight. A decoy, huh? Clever. Where's the mine? My kit. Is it a perception problem? Can I not inspect? Can I not spot it? I don't see a mine this time. Weird. Was that randomly generated? Huh. I don't know why there's no mine this time. Or why I'm not triggering it if that's the case. What's down here? Another sleeping bag? Maybe the one they actually used. Why do they keep leaving their sleeping bags behind though is the weird thing. Dog meat? You wandering around? More Gwinnett Stout. He seems to leave that a lot uh, behind a lot. Dog meat? Where are you headed? Oh, we're going for it. Alright. I thought that was like a genuine stop. Mostly just a distraction. Try not to get blowed up, alright boy? Oop, chip. And I'll try not to fall in holes in the bridge. Don't wanna... Don't wanna return to, to Dark Souls 2. That whole incident on the way to the chariot. Hey, friend. Fuck you. Uh, fuck- oh no, I missed. Awkward. Good. Oh. You get him, dog? Cool, you guys got him. Oh. Oh. Yep, dog meat had him. I may not need to shoot right now. I have two companions, and they're kind of teaming up in a, an effective manner. And it helped me conserve my ammo, because I actually don't have that much for this gun. Which is a bummer. So I'm clearly doing well with rifles so far. Okay, he's up in my business, and I'm not a, so much of a fan, so... He can back off. Bitch be frontin', yo. Do not appreciate. Gotta respect. Alright. Where are you going, dog meat? And why weren't you helping me? Oh, rads. Is there something there? Preservation shelter? Oh. Weird. Alright, um, really quickly here. F. There we go. Fuck y'alls. Uh-oh, I need, I need more barrels than <laughs> the shotgun. There we go. That's the better gun for the situation. The rifle's just kind of awkward at, in, with melee enemies like this. 
You alright, buddy? Ow, rude. Finish him off. I need to reload. There we go. Alright, rads are becoming a little bit of a problem here. F, uh, did... You have to press F and then down on the D-pad or, or S and then press E to use a stim pack. There's gotta be a better way. Maybe I can assign it to a hotkey or something. Because right now that, that using favorites is really awkward. Okay, I'm curious. Let's take a quick look around in here. If we're just gonna wander on past. Ooh! Potatoes. Oh, this is this is this is that Mad Max thing where they uh they just have the wrong words for a bunch of stuff. Tension trigger, nope. Makeshift bomb, nope. Rude. Uh cash register. Bugle. Oh cool, spine. That's what all <laughs> that's what I always wanted. What's in here? Ooh, drugs. And stim pack and right away. That's all good news. I want me some sweet drugs, yo. Anything else? Jukebox, do you work? Not apparently. Probably not anymore. Hey, buddy. Doing alright? Oh, this place is all lit up. Is it currently inha inhabited by raiders? Can I go in here too? Nope, that's all sealed off. Thank god they sealed off some of the buildings so I can't check everywhere, because I might if I had the, the opportunity. Alright, where are we going, boy? Where are we going? Tracking known mercenary. Exercise extreme caution. Damn. Hell of a party happened here. Alert. Critical signs. Alert. Critical signs. What have we here? Error. System corrupt. I can't feel my legs. That all you got for me? Oh, here we go. What happened here? Error. Operator deceased. Threat level Omega. He... killed... us. We're still on track. Hopefully he's not much further. <laughs> Nothing else? No follow-up? Alright. Can I loot his body for parts? Alright, let's go. Dog meat? Gotta find this Kellogg asshole. All these broken down machines and pe- oh, hello. Hello? Hey, uh oh. Saw okay, that was a little startling up close. No! Bad. No, bad. Alright, I might be- I should probably vats that shit, because apparently I do a bad job. Get off my dog. Alright, we saved your ass. You alright? You saved my life. Yeah, I did. Please. Take this. See, he knows how it works. Whoa, 250. I've done genuine law. <laughs> I've done actual story missions up to this point that did, that paid me a hundred. In fact, almost everything's paid me a hundred. Random dudes like, bam, 250. You shot three dogs. Good job. <laughs> There's a disparity here. Is what I'm getting at. All right, that's like two stim packs, I think. Granted, it seems to be stupid to buy anything in this game, because. Uh, you can just- I think you just craft your own stim packs. Like, in general, crafting seems to be the best way to get most things. Cause, uh, paying for it's fucking expensive so far, as, what, as far as I can tell. Unless this is gonna be like The Witcher, where it seems like high numbers at first- that dog's got one hell of a nose. They'll sniff Kellogg out. Could be like Witcher, where I start off with, uh, thinking everything's expensive, but then suddenly I have a billion dollars and nothing's worth buying ever. <laughs> what am I- I'm sorry, what am I wearing right now? Oh, hang on. Inventory. Apparel. Let's get that silver shroud costume on for proper stat bonuses. My bad. You're glowy looking. Can I loot you? Oh, there's just freaky glowy plants everywhere. Makes sense. Government property, no trespassing. Getting close. I can feel it. What do you think, Go boy? Around. Was this our man? How long was this guy bleeding for? We gotta stick together, pal. At least until we find Kellogg. Oh, here it goes. Oh, we find something? 
I don't think the government pro the government property was the important part here, I guess, because I think that was back there. So it's another bomb downtown. Oh, that's a big one. Is that where we're going? Are we going right past it again? Oh. Fuck. Oh, hello. Bad. Damn you, wildlife. I thought we were dealing with uh, enemy shooters. Just these assholes. That was some surprising accuracy from a shotgun. I guess if it's just a big, gross bu bubble monster on wings, uh, a spread shot with shrapnel is probably the thing to do. Ah, uh, it's already open. Bomber. Or already empty, I mean. Board it up. Alright, boy. Let's go. We're wiping out this wasteland, making it safer for everyone, apparently. How does anyone survive around here? Because I fight something every two minutes out here. So we're going to Fort Hagen, but of course I'm going to look at this. What's going on in here? An entire set of, uh, pool table balls. They, they have to make so many assets for these games, don't they? Drinking glasses. And when I say drinking glasses, it makes it sound like I'm talking about, like, oh yeah, these are the glasses I wear when I drink. I think they call those beer goggles. Um... Office desk fan, ca cafeteria. Ah, uh, I just overloaded myself. Damn it! But there's so many things around here. I need it all, you know. I need it all. Camera. That's got to be valuable. Hello, corpse. All right. Teddy bear. Can I look at the book? Ah. The, is there a weird clown down there? The book just seems like it'd be handy if I could grab it. Baseball uniform. Let's give you a strength bonus or something. It feels it feels weird. I can't look at the book because I feel like that would be handy for me. Don't 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 see anything else around here. Here. Let's just give you some of this shit to make up for the fact that I'm weighing my down self down like a jackass. Take some of these suits, maybe. Drifter outfit. Baseball uniform gives you strength and agility. All right. Assault gas mask. Probably not gonna use that bowler hat. Uh, fedora is worth keeping on hand, probably. Let's see. And miscellaneous. Oh crap, not miscellaneous. I meant I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Um, pack of cigarettes. What else did I give you? Don't want to give those ones away on accident. I meant to go to junk. Do 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 do. I'm gonna have so much inventory space in a second here. There we go. And I'll just have to meet up with characters like this to make sure that I uh, set myself up properly. There we go. I'll just have to meet up with him and our other friend promptly when given the opportunity to uh, go into crafting mode. There we go. Back to my hunting rifle. All right, boy. What'd you find over here? Is this the place? Is he in here, boy? I knew dog meat would sniff our man out. Let's you and I take it from here. Give our four-legged friend a break. All right, bye, dog meat. Good friend. If he, I, I like it if, he, if he'll just keep magically showing up when needed in the story. Because then I don't have to go hunting for him in that situation. All right, I predict a fighting situation to happen here, so... Rat away. Get that health. There we go. Get our full meter back, and then go ahead and use a stim pack. Making us much healthier to deal with whatever comes next. Hello, garage. It's not, oh, it's another, another red rocket. Uh, a Braxo. Hot plate, duct tape, low torch. I'm sorry, I'm, I shouldn't get carried away too much. Let's look for the vitals. Power armor station. Some people point out that, that uh, the situation on top of the uh, that tower was clearly a situation where it would have been handy to have my power armor. Don't, I don't think about it very much. It's not a thought, it's not a concept that comes to me naturally when I think about Fallout fuse. That just seems like a more useful item, so I'm gonna grab it. Gas canisters. That also seems handy. Armor workbench. Subway token. Oh, that's not what I was going for. Sorry, I can't escape. I'm stuck in this animation now. I'm gonna go check out the weapon workbench. What are you hiding? As people pointed out, I probably should try to upgrade my rifle to be more useful. 
Might not have the proper opportunity, though, to do that until I get back to my town. Is this what this was the armor workbench, right? Out here? All odds and ends in this one. Yep, weapons. Let's go ahead and craft. That's a nice little setup. Nice hunting rifle. What can I modify here? So I have no oh. And a receiver and nothing else, huh? Barrel. So nothing says available. Long barrel, for example. I need screws. Okay. So more than anything, I probably want to scope standard standard sights. Glow sights. Improved focus, better accuracy. Nuclear material. Wow. Uh, short scope. Improved magnification. Superior sighted accuracy. Adhesive glass and screw. A long scope. Alright, so there's, there's definitely options here, but I can't really do a lot of them until I get certain upgrades. Like Gun Nut, for example. And, uh... I don't even know what that one... That one might require a high level of science or something I don't have. But I also am going to need to go back to town where I'll have access to more of these supplies. So that's not going to happen for now. It was worth checking, though. It was worth checking. Alright, back to getting inside this building. That's not a... Oh! Someone spotted me? Oh shit, turret. Okay. You surprised me a bit there. I got this though. Oh yeah, it does. Except for the cloud of smoke. It's a little less clear. Oh, there's another one. What's that? Alright, they don't want us in here. I get it. You can't see me. Ha uh ha. -huh. Can, can you finish him up? I don't really want to... Do I need to waste another bullet here? There you go. Good job. Any more turrets? Sweet, sweet ammo. I'll take your electronics. Is that the way inside? Just a vent. Alright. That's, that's more piece of that turret. I assume if we go up top, there's either a way down inside, or the base is actually up here. Bam! Something sneak attack. Uh-oh. Oh, crap. You know what? Bad, bad, bad mix. Bad mix. Bad things happened. Bad things happened. If I could just reestablish stealth. Just gotta work together here. He's about to take that one out in a second here. Oh. Gotta watch out. There we go. A lot of turrets. A lot of turrets. A lot of experience for me, though. It's fine. Can't open that? Alright. See if I can spot the next ones before they spot me. Get that experience bonus. I mean, that damage bonus from the sneak attack. Interesting you can sneak attack a freaking... Hey, you can sneak attack a turret. Don't know if I buy that concept. Let's see. Probably stuff down there. And maybe a turret, so let's watch out. Ladder. Chalk. Ooh, bobby pins. Fantastic. By collecting enough of those, I'll never have to think about it again. Can I just fall through the ceiling? Well, there's a hole. So I could drop it down there if I wanted to. Might not take the fall very well. So maybe that's not the thing to do right now. Ooh. Hello. Alright. Look for a way back up, because I've kind of stranded myself a little bit. Ooh. More chunk of that guy. Let's warp back on up here. I don't know if warp is not the word for this. Alright, go for the jump. Sweet. Jumps are weirdly... Jumps feel weirdly floaty and stuff. Alright. Nothing nothing else to loot from that one. Alright, we're on top. Now it's just about finding a way inside. Any doors? Oh, hello. Yep, that's the way in to Fort Hagen. Oh, more loot. Sweet. I think we're off to a good start here. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching, like always. This is probably a decent stopping point for the moment. So, 
Last episode, we finally got Valentine out of the vault. So this episode, we started tracking down the bad guy that took that. It's probably the guy that took our son, and whose house I currently stole the key to, free of charge. All that nice business. Next episode, we're gonna find out exactly what's inside Fort Hagen, and either we'll either find him or we'll find evidence of where he went.